Hi Aquarius, welcome in and thank you so much for joining. Be sure to only take messages that resonate and how they resonate for your situation. If you are cross-watching, just keep in mind that the energies could be reversed. If the messages are not for you, check your other signs or check back next time. Spirit, what are the messages for Aquarius? What are the messages for Aquarius? Messages for Aquarius, please. Okay, Nine of Wands. Six of Cups. So we're going to see a lot of this, guys. Um, there is somebody here from your past. You have history with this person. The this person hurt you. Okay? You're not very trusting of this past person. I feel like some of you are even still licking your wounds here. Okay? Um... Let's see. Somebody wants to extend an apology, Aquarius. I feel like someone is genuinely sorry for hurting you. They're really in their feelings the rest of this month, guys. Really deep in their feelings. And their feelings are motivating them to actually come forward and apologize. They know what they did was wrong. And I feel this person is having a hard time, like living their mistakes on repeat here with the Six of Cups. But you may also be living in your head, like on repeat for what they did. With this being the mutual energy. This person really broke your trust. Not only just for them, but I feel like for, like for, connections in general I do feel like it you know some you know it may have hurt you but there's an energy of it opening your eyes as well um, and intuitively I'm feeling like a lot of you guys are a lot of you guys were put in this place of uncomfortability and it could be due to your guides wanting you to open your eyes and not be so naive towards people okay that was kind of hard for me to say um so i do apologize if that was hard for you to hear but i do feel that um how you see them so you know you see them as having unfinished business because they never apologized You can see them as avoiding apologizing or just avoiding you in general, avoiding taking accountability. You're not satisfied, right, with their actions. But, you know, I do feel like this has caused you to go within. And, you know, this is you mastering yourself. I feel like you guys know yourself better now. I do feel like a lot of you guys have been trying to bury yourself in some type of project. It's like you're working on something here or working on yourself uh, to ignore or avoid your uh, feelings. Some of you might have been hyper fixated on someone. And so you're like, let me just put all my energy into work or into this project. Okay, that could be where you're at now or where you were. But I do feel like you're building a new skill here or you could be mastering a skill here. So it's almost like you are transmuting this negative situation, this negative energy. You're transmuting it into something positive because you have taken all of this pain and you're turning it into something beautiful here. Or you have. How does this person see Aquarius right now? see Aquarius <sighs> wow 
Well, they spy on you. They watch you. They're watching you somehow. They're seeing you through um, a screen, right, uh, is what I'm getting. That's the message I got. Um, they're very curious as to what you've been up to since all of this transpired, Aquarius. And I am getting for a lot of you guys, if you are pub publicly, you know, posting things, they've seen it, they watch it. There's a lot of curiosity, okay, when it comes to you wanting your attention. Some of you guys may have become successful in something and they know about that. Um, but the Queen of Wands, the Six of Wands, uh, and you being <laughs> feeling the Eight of Pentacles, some of you guys had a glow up or you will, and this person is going to see it with their own eyes, okay? You could, of course, uh, work in the public eye. Look at this for how they feel. The star. They want a clean slate with you. You're the center of their attention, okay? Um, <sighs> they see you as a star. Like I said, you could have been very successful in something or you are about to be because, you know, time is fluid. This could be pr predictive energy, but some of you guys are already there is what I'm getting. You, you could be, like, receiving some type of fame or recognition in some way. Um, but they definitely see you as, you know, your true authentic self. Like they really see you like how you would want this person to see you is how they see you. I'm getting chills. Now, some of you guys, um, I'm also picking up on like, even if this person were to apologize to you, you could be in this energy of like, eh, well, I don't know if I would really accept their apology or maybe I would just accept it and move on with my life because it is what it is. Okay. Um, is also what I'm getting. So what do they want? What do, um, they want from Aquarius? What do they want from Aquarius? To come out of the cold. Capricorn energy. To get out of this negative place with you. To make amends, okay? Um, I will say there's an energy of this person wanting you to be just as fixated on them. Like it's not, it's an energy of them hoping you are. Because I do feel like this person is wanting to get you stuck on them. And so the six of cups can indicate a reunion. Okay. Uh, a reconciliation. Now, I feel like this person has every hope, okay, with the star, the five of pentacles, the devil, to get you attached to them or reattach themselves to you. And it's because they're starting to feel that, um, that energetic distance, like, because I don't think this is an act on your part. I think you are truly actively trying to heal and move forward. Some of you already have. And it's like they can feel that you are not as fixated on them. And they, they energetically, their being, okay, their energy wants that back. Because I feel like there was a sense of you feeding them in a way or feeding their ego. Because there was this, that's why this person watches you, Aquarius. Because like, somehow, you know, they feed off of your energy. Queen of Cups. Why the Queen of Cups? Wow. So this is them wanting to reunite with you. They want you to feel something for them. Okay? I'm getting like this person would like for you to be happy uh, if they were to return. 
And this is somebody that really wants to return to your life. And they're like, well, I, I you know, I, I wonder if Aquarius would be happy if I returned. Like, it's a very emotional. I can't even describe the emotion I'm feeling off of this person. Um, but it's like they really want to feel you is really what I'm getting. They want to feel your energy. They want to feel how you, like, they want to know how you feel. And there's an energy of here, somebody reconciling or reuniting with you to see, like, how you feel. But again, like, I can't stress it enough. It feels to me like you guys are actively trying to work on something else here. So what are their next actions towards Aquarius? Ace of sort to say I'm sorry. Y'all, I, I do see you getting an apology from this person. If you don't, they really know and they really feel, they really feel like they need to reconcile here for their own mental health, okay? Um, they really want to tell you they're sorry. They really want to just say it, like, to you. This is someone that wants to just say to you, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what I did. I'm sorry for the things I said. Yeah, they want to come out of conflict with you. All right. Well, let's see. What's their hidden truth? I watch your social media. This person stalks you. They watch the hell out of you, Aquarius. Okay, they like to keep tabs on you because it's the only way they can pull energy off of you right now. So it says, I hid who I really am from you. Okay. All right, guys, those are your messages. If this resonated and you like my style, I do appreciate you hitting that like button as it does help support my channel. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Until next time, bye.